when uh, one considers that we are located in the Cape Nature flagship reserve where you've got um, these beautiful coastline at 60 kilometers together with the 30,000 odd hectares of, of Fainbos Reserve and within that a number of species that occur um, here and nowhere else in the world um, is really something to behold. I'd got a marine protected area, um, which is one of the biggest ones, the biggest single no-take zones um, on the South African coastline. It's got the uh, wetlands, which is a Ramsar site, and it's got the world-renowned whale trail, so definitely uh, all in one package. It's a nice five-day hiking trail where you can really just come shut down, unwind and just reflect a bit. In terms of swimming spots, in terms of just snorkeling, in terms of just solitude, I think the whale trail and just the coastline, it's got it all. Talking about success stories, our vulture colony, the last count that we had was in December of this year and the population was standing at 265 individuals. It's one of the few growing vulture colonies in South Africa. The Duke Collection is a private company that got involved as a partner with Cape Nature 10 years ago in the facilities, the accommodation, doing the activities. It offers an interpretive marine walk where you would go down to the coastline with guests and the guide would interpret the intertidal zone and the marine rock pools. We also do mountain bike trails where guests could either hire a bicycle themselves and explore the reserve or one would go out with a guide. We have introduced a eco boat trip which takes place on the Duop Flay, which is a specialised birding activity, particularly looking at the, the water fell on the, on the flay. And we also do stargazing, which is an interpretive night sky activity, looking at the, the constellations from this beautiful sky. The wildlife that occurs at Duhap has become very habituated to the movement of people around us. And here they, they tend to sort of stand and look at you and allow you to get quite close to them. It has a sense of um, peace for them and they don't feel threatened at all by uh, the human activity around them and it's great to be able to walk amongst them. <laughs>